Hello, this is Jeff with Vegan Walk, and today I just want to talk real quick about a comment I got on the roasted vegetable lasagna video that I have on my YouTube channel. The comment was by Gina D, and she said it would have been helpful if I would have tasted the lasagna, you know, and shared whether or not I liked it, and if I had any ideas for, you know, tweaking it. Well, I really can't speak for anybody else when it comes to taste. Tastes are acquired, and from my understanding, all tastes are acquired except for human breast milk. My tastes are completely different than, than most people because I don't add sugar or salt or oil to things. And if people eat a lot of processed foods or pre-made foods or they go out to eat a lot, they're always adding those three ingredients to pretty much everything. So you'll be like overstimulated and really want to come back for more. But when you get away from those things and cook more at home and you don't add those things at all to your recipes, then you're going to really taste those ingredients naturally occurring in the foods that you eat, which is great because that's so much healthier. So I really wanted to get that out there because if you get like the How Not to Die cookbook, those ingredients are not in any of the recipes because they're trying to make the healthiest foods possible and adding those ingredients are not healthy at all. If somebody's trying to get on a vegan diet, just know in a few weeks, you know, it's, it's only going to take a few weeks and then you're going to really like have a whole different understanding or appreciation for food. And it's kind of like smoking, you know, you become desensitized real quick to smoking and eventually you kind of crave it and psychologically think you need it. But in the end, you don't. It's just a stupid habit. And when you finally realize that and quit, you're like, wow. This stuff stinks, it's nasty. You know, same thing with eating meat, eggs, and dairy. That's nasty if you really think about it. And all that's acquired, so you can unlearn that just as quick as you can learn it. That's really all I wanted to say about taste. I mean, you could get really deep into it scientifically, um, but just know that it's acquired and nothing tastes better than healthy. I love that quote. And I, I got that from Dr. Greger, who I think got it from somebody else, but I don't recall who, but I use it all the time. Nothing tastes better than healthy. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.